What's up everybody? Marvel the Cross 316 back with another comic book flash back in the day folks. We are looking at Daredevil issue number 16. This issue came out in May of 1965 and today folks we're going to see Daredevil fight the amazing Spider-Man and so we got one epic battle here to look at and exactly who is behind all this. Why is Spider-Man and Daredevil fighting each other? We're going to find all this out. Today's title is Enter Spider-Man. So we got a cool issue to look at today. And I believe that this, and you can correct me, but this is the first time that John Romita draws Spider-Man. And we know how many times John Romita has drawn Spider-Man in the Amazing Spider-Man series. And so this is pretty cool stuff. Um, like I said, Daredevil is going to go up against spider-man here and we have the mystery of the masked marauder too to deal with and so we're going ahead and let's go ahead now and look at today's issue we start out the issue and we have all three of our favorite people here foggy nelson karen page and matt murdoch they are working together and we had the tv on and they're showing on the news the photographs of spider-man's most recent battle with the masked marauder fighting masked marauders men and it was at the world motors building and so what we see here is that they're talking about how great spider-man is and daredevil knows a lot about spider-man they teamed up once way back in amazing spider-man issue number 16 and so that's the last time that daredevil has seen spider-man in continuity here and so what we see is that uh, Foggy Nelson starts to talk bad about Daredevil and he's like you know he's just not nowhere near as cool as Spider-Man and we see that um, Matt Murdock is actually going to get offended here and we see even also Karen Page he says Foggy Nelson how can you say that have you forgotten all the times that Daredevil has helped us why I even owe my life to him and he's like granted honey but He'll make sure that you never forget it. And so meanwhile, while they're talking, we see that the mass Marauder, the main villain for this issue, is setting up his plans here. And his plan is to distract Spider-Man by allowing Spider-Man to think that Daredevil is a threat to him. And he's going to use his men here. They're all in these um, different Daredevil costumes here. These classic red costume here. And so what he's going to do is he's going to send his men out, um, about two of them. I don't know why he had all of them dress up, but he's only going to use two of these guys to basically um, distract Spider-Man and think that Spider-Man is a villain to him. And so this one guy, he's going to mouth off to the mass Marauder here. And we see that the Marauder then is going to blind him with this blast here. And tells him that temporarily paralysis, paralysis of your optic nerves wears off. You'll have another chance to serve me. Till then, take him away. And so now he is going to go. A Master Marauder is going to go along with his master plan here. So see Spider-Man is swinging around town here. When all of a sudden he sees one of the billy clubs of Daredevil swing right at him. And then that guy is going to leave. Spider-Man's like, what is up with Daredevil? I thought he was my friend. And so that guy returns back. Then we see that the Marauder is going to send one more person to strike Spider-Man. And we see here that once again, Spider-Man's like, what the heck is wrong with Daredevil? I thought we were cool. We teamed up once. And so has he turned yellow or something? So we see that um, Karen Page, Foggy Nelson, leaving for the day. She wants to go out with Daredevil, I mean, not, not with Daredevil, but Matt Murdock here. She doesn't know that Daredevil is Matt Murdock. But we see that although Matt Murdock would like to take out um, Karen Page on a date, he has more pressing matters, and that is that he's heard that there's been Daredevil sightings around the city, and someone is... Um, trying to cause trouble so the real daredevil is going to come since he's so we see daredevil is going to be you know searching for these fake daredevils and all of a sudden he's stopped by spider-man here 
you know, we see that Spider-Man doesn't want to hear anything about Daredevil. And Daredevil's like, what do you mean I'm a traitor? And we see that Spider-Man thinks that he is a yellow coward. And this is where we're going to see an epic battle between Spider-Man and Daredevil. Spider-Man was the first to attack. And so Daredevil's going to be on the defensive here throughout the remainder of this issue. And I'll just let y'all look at some of the cool action scenes drawn by the great John Romita Sr., and so we see that this catches the police's attention here as he, they see two um, crime fighters fighting on top of a building here. Meanwhile, we see that the masked marauder learns of it. And now all of his men are going to follow Plan W accordingly. So they round about into their truck here. And they're going to make it to that, um, they're going to go to that place, the motor place where they can steal the, the hydraulic hoist. And there, there's like this hydraulic engine that they're after. And that's what his main plan is all about, is getting this engine. And so we see that he has all of these cool gadgets that he's going to send his men to do. They go and they're going to steal the plans. And they said, it's just what we wanted, the detailed plans for the XB390 engine. And that's exactly what the Marauder wants. And so, meanwhile, we see the mass marauder has been caught by the police. He's been sighted, but he's going to blind them with um, what he used earlier here with that um, one guy. And so, both of these police officers go down. And so, we see that the mass marauder was successful. And he's also saying, I should write Daredevil and Spider-Man a thank you letter for them distracting the police while I got away with my plans. So they get in the car, and he's going to drive away. Meanwhile, Spider-Man and Daredevil are fighting on this rooftop still. And there's no... Um, Daredevil and Spider-Man just continue to fight each other. There's no way for Spider-Man to reason with him. So Daredevil is going to have to tie him to this pole in order for him to get away from Spider-Man. And so that's exactly what we see here as we continue to look at this issue. And so Spider-Man's going to break away, but Daredevil's finally gotten away. And he's going to go check on his Aunt May, as we see right here. He learns that um, Spider-Man and Daredevil are have been you know, looked at as criminals here, thanks to J. Jonah Jameson, as there's a newspaper out saying that the Mass Marauder gang strikes again, stealing the vital XB390 engine. And Daredevil and Spider-Man were um, found battling out on that rooftop. And so Peter Parker thinks that Daredevil must have been in cahoots with the Masked Marauder. Meanwhile, we see that Matt Murdock thinks that Spider-Man may be in cahoots. And so we see that Matt Murdock returns to the office with Foggy, Nelson, and um, Karen Page the next day. And we see that they're going to basically continue to talk about what's going on. And so we see that the Mass Marauder is says, Stealing these blueprints is the, only the first step of my carefully worked out master plan. There are underworld organizations, syndicates, even nations who would pay any amount for the secret of the XB390, but I'm not ready to sell yet. So that's what his big thing is. He wants to sell the engine to make money. So Spider-Man's swinging around town, and he his spider sense begins to uh, go off here. And he says he's sensing somebody, and it's the presence of Daredevil. And he looks inside the window. He doesn't see Daredevil, but he sees these three people, Karen Page, Matt Murdock, and Foggy Nelson. And he doesn't suspect that this blind guy, Matt Murdock, is Daredevil. He thinks that Foggy Nelson is Daredevil, so he's going to uh, swing inside the building here and he's going to threaten <laughs> foggy nelson here so that's where we end this issue folks we see that spider-man thinks that foggy nelson is daredevil and matt murdoch can't do anything about it without revealing his secret and so what is going to happen coming up next folks will uh, foggy nelson get out of this situation as spider-man thinks that he is daredevil what is going to happen we're going to find all this out in issue number 17. I hope to see you there.
But until then, go ahead now and give this video a like. Comment down below what you liked about this issue. Subscribe if you have not. And I will see y'all in the next one.